everybody out there on the interwebs. It is I, Nikki Fredard, back with another exciting video. Now, as you may recall, today, as the time I'm recording this video, is the 10th anniversary of a certain franchise that I know. What is that franchise, you may ask? Why, it's none other than Angry Birds, of course. Now, I was a fan of Angry Birds for a pretty long time, like around 2010, stuff like that. And last time I did a video on Angry Birds, I did a video on these particular, these set of birds right here. You know, all of these, these birds right here, to even this behemoth of a custom-made plushie of this, which is very cool. Let's see, look at the teeth and and that but, but but we're not here to talk about them so so they, they can get out of here they're trash we're not talking about them today so they can they can stay on the floor for now instead we're going to be reviewing this book this book is the world of angry birds official guide now this is a book published by puffin books this is a non-american book from what i've heard and it's pretty rare hard to find and stuff. I got this book off on eBay for like five dollars. <laughs> yeah, it's not that expensive. It's uh, it's from Rovio. It's like around, this book is like around, made around like the 2013 stuff. So obviously there's not going to be anything, not, no movie designs, just good old classic Angry Birds. So let us begin by reading this book. Okay, here's the pages. See right here, first published in 2013, so there it is. All the contents. Now, let us take let us take a moment to admire this beautiful illustration of the island. The people of this book really know what they're doing and they're really great artists. Okay. Somewhere in the world of Angry Bird, in, in a world of flock of Angry Birds, and a kingdom of bad piggies, live side by side, but not in harmony. There is a strange and mysterious place known as Piggy Island. See, there's the island right here. And then, well, if anyone has a QR code scanner, you can try to scan that in, but I don't know. This, this is pretty outdated, so if you want to try it, be my guest. And here's the Mighty Eagle. He's going to... He's the guide of this book. And then, here is a map of the island, and your guide to Piggy Island continues. I'm not going to read everything, but I am going to show you these, these beautiful illustrations of the landscapes in the, you see in the games. So, this is... This is, uh... This is... Bread for Baird Forest. It's a really nice place. Then you have Islands in the Sky, which is a nice landscape. And then Cornitopia Woods. I, I, sorry if I cannot pronounce that, but there's that as well. It's got a nice forest, got some apples, some wildlife. It's really interesting. Birds of a feather. And then 10 things you need to know about the bad piggies. So you gonna go through here so you can read everything. Also, King Pig's name is Smooth Cheeks. Funny. Okay. And then uh, here's the Angry Birds. Very interesting. And then meet the birds. So then this gives you a, a character bios of all the birds that you see in the games and their basically shows their personalities, their likes and dislikes and stuff. So I'm just going to slow this down just so you can read this. So it's red.
Chuck. The blues. Okay, bomb. Tilda. Stella. Terence. Uh, so this is Red narrating this. It's not Terence because he doesn't talk. Bubbles, my favorite bird. And Hal, who is the least used Angry Bird character in history.
and even the mighty eagle. And this, this is not me. This is what happens when you buy stuff on eBay. You just don't know what kind of little pranksters are going to do stuff like this. So yeah, that's really unfortunate. Okay, here's the cobbled plateau, the great cliffs. This is where poached eggs is taking place in. Mighty hoax. Danger above. A big setup. Ham em high, and Desert Island is where the episode Ham and High takes place in. It's like a desert place sense. Mine and Dine takes place in pig mines. Pretty self-explanatory. Bird day party. Surf and turf is taking place in South Beach. And Angry Bird Seasons, the second game. Trick or treat. Giant Red Valley is where this episode takes place in. Season's Greetings takes place in the Snowy Peak in the Crown Mountain. Rocks and Kisses. Go Green, Get Lucky. Easter Eggs. This place is taking place in Slingshot Woods is where probably where the birds got their slingshot from. Summer Pig Nick, taking place in the Golden Fields. The Mooncake Festival. Hamoween, taking place in the Square Forest. Wreck the Halls, taking place in Winter Wonderland. Year of the Dragon. Taking place in the Bamboo Forest. Cherry Blossom. Piglantis taking place in, well, Piglantis. Pretty self-explanatory. Back to school. Haunted Hogs. Winter Wonder Ham. Abraca Bacon. And then the book, of, and here's the section with all about the pigs. Everything you need to know about these green swine. And then here is a message from King Pig himself. And here is the stupid meter for every single pig. For Professor Big, with Professor Pig being the smartest, all the way down is King Pig being the stupidest. Don't know how the king is stupider than his minions, but who cares? Even King Pig is commenting on why he is so low. And here is Pig City, the king's castle. 
and the city itself. And just like the birds, the pigs also have their own character bios, so let's go through this as well, starting with King Pig. Chef Pig. Foreman Pig. Actually, hold on for one second. If you go into here, things were better in the good old days. Mudbeer was a real king. So, I'm going to drop you all with a little theory. I think the Angry Birds movie is a prequel. Because this is... Because in the movie, Leonard is King Mudbeard. And in this book, it's... The king pick we know now is King Smooth Cheeks. So... That's just my personal theory. I think the Angry Birds movie is a prequel. Because they had a ton of eggs too. And now there's only three. So, yeah. But that's just the theory. Okay, okay I'll stop. Let's just, let's just move on. Here's Professor Pig. Another thing is that apparently the birds and pigs used to get along. Or at least not in this page, but in another one. Here's Chronicle Pig, another unused Angry Birds character. Hold on a 
a second. Every stage of picky history is there. All the great victories as well as well as the loses too. The weird thing is that the status keeps moving around. Very oh the statues keep moving around very odd. Very odd, sorry. Oh, that's an easy one. I know the biggest secret on the whole island. It's... No, it's gone again. Sorry. There's Corporal Pig. Finally, the minion pigs. Egg eating ceremonies. And the last word from the herd. We go on to Angry Birds Space. And here's a retelling of what happened. And that's how Icebird came to be. That's how they get captured. Goes back into space. And that's how the space birds were born. Super Red. Laser bird. The lightning birds. Space bomb. The incredible Terrence. Cosmic bubbles. Ice bird. And then the space pigs. Space king pig. Space foreman pig. Space corporal pig. Space minion pigs. And surprisingly, his name is not Fat Pig. His name is Big Bork. I don't know why they chose that name, but eh, whatever. I always call him Fat Pig, so who cares? <laughs> Explore the claw. And then, is your best mate a secret space pig? Space oddity. Angry bird space attack. Space egg. Pig bang. They don't show any illustrations in this version, so it's a shame. Cold cuts. 
Fry Me to the Moon, Utopia, Red Planet, Pig Dipper, Eggstroids, Danger Zone, and an Angry Birds Quiz. That's it. Okay. And that's it. This is the World of Angry Birds official guidebook. You can buy it on eBay for like $5. Though, expect some stuff to be in the book. Because I don't know. But that's it. Happy birthday, Angry Birds. Hashtag bring back 2012, even though I don't say much about it, but I'm secretly cheering for those guys in the background. I just don't say anything, but I still think they should bring back the old games. They should, they should just lower it down with the movie designs and stuff. And that's it. That is all for today. Tune in next time for whenever I decide to upload Angry Birds stuff, which will take me like, I don't know, like maybe a couple of years or so. Alright, see you guys then.